Hi everyone, I'm here at Iceworks Ice Arena. I'm done training for the day and I got a great new video for you today. But first I would like to thank Patrick for supporting my skating. And it's been a couple of months since my last video, so I'm making a vlog. So check it out and you'll find out what I've been up to. Today I will be showing you how to do quick forward inside edges. This exercise is often used by skaters to warm up their edges when first getting on the ice. However, it is also good for general practice as it strengthens edge control. I usually don't put too much thought into this exercise and instead rely on feel to know what I am doing. I also prefer to do it with the arms down as it flows better this way. Doing it with the arms up will reduce your quickness, but you still want to twist the shoulder of the skating foot in front and the shoulder of the free foot back, then switch them as you switch feet. The same rule applies when doing it with the arms up. The key to doing this exercise is to ride your heels and to press into your edges. Doing this will make you come around quicker and you will also build speed. If you skate on the balls of the feet, you will tend to pitch forward, and you won't be able to generate the same amount of edge pressure. There is an edge pressure threshold that you can't drop below, otherwise you won't be doing it correctly. That pressure level will vary from skater to skater due to differing body types and sizes. But if you're gaining speed and each edge roars from the pressure, then you're doing it correctly. As my lobes tighten, I'll lean into the circle. Here it may look like I will fall in, but I don't due to the speed and edge pressure. I need that lean in order to avoid being thrown outside the circle and to maintain the maximum pressure. If you look closely, you will notice that I set my skate on an inside edge, then deepen the edge as I press in order to get the pressure which creates the speed. Maintaining smooth knee and ankle action will give you power and flow. Avoid setting your blade flat on the ice and then try to push it over. Instead, set it on a clear inside edge right away, then really press into it. While it may look scary, the edge pressure is such that I feel like I'm riding on a rail track. If I applied the same amount of pressure to a flat blade, it would skid or jump. Pressing the edge keeps me feeling stable and secure. The lean combined with the edge pressure gives you a very strong grip. I don't rely on edge sharpness, but rather edge pressure to maintain the grip on the ice. While this exercise looks simple, it isn't. It requires good edges and strong ankles. 
I try to show exercises for skaters of different levels, and if you are struggling with this, check out episode 3, Basic Consecutive Edges. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, comments, or requests, leave a message in the comment section. And for latest channel updates, check out my latest vlog video.